What's up everyone? How's it going? Okay. So I wanna touch up I wanna to touch up on the subject of excuses. So excuses are complete bullshit. Okay? Don't give out excuses. There's a reason you didn't do something. There's a reason you didn't do well in something. Take responsibility, it's your own damn fault. Okay? And that's the nicest way I could put it. And I think that's something I highly respect of one of my professors is well, she doesn't say it like that. That's my interpretation of it. But she's really hard on us and she pushes us to really think. And I think that's something that a lot of professors and teachers have really died down on, especially because everyone's so intact with their feelings. To hell with your feelings. Just like in Scary Movie 3, when Shaquille O'Neal is telling... Oh, wait, no. It's Dr. Phil telling Shaquille O'Neal to hell with your feelings because he's tired of it. It's complete bullshit, okay? That's the reason why you didn't do it. You didn't do it because you were too lazy. Because you didn't want to get up and actually do it. Okay? Now, another thing. You have to take responsibility. If it is to be, it's up to me. That's something I live by as I take responsibility for basically everyone around me. And I think that's very important. And that's actually a, a leader quality is to take responsibility for everyone because it has to be up to you because you can prevent something from happening you are powerful each one of you is powerful we're all fucking powerful do not degrade yourself you're very special amazing compassionate loving caring probably bratty but who isn't we're all human Whatever you can control, have that be the best thing you can, just have it be the best thing. Don't dwell on things you can't control. Though That's out of your hands. Honestly, I just, I just let it go. Because if I can't control it, why am I going to dwell on it? Because I can't change it. Avoid negative people. Negative people are not worth your time. You surround yourself with all these negative people and it's going to bring you down. No, you're much better than that. And if you think of yourself as a negative person and if that touched you, cut your shit, okay? I'm sorry, but that's, that's how it is. I love everyone in this world. And I know that's a very bad thing because I care so deeply about mankind and I have a feeling that it can change when I know it very well probably can't but I know that I can make a difference in someone's life you know I broadcasted one time and someone messaged me directly and they were like you really helped change my day I was having a shitty day you really helped out you know guys I've been I've been helping others for a long ass time. I helped my mom a lot. We went through a lot of stuff and I don't want you guys to feel bad for me. I went through a lot of stuff. I was I was real fat, fatter than I am now. I don't know. That's another self-image thing we'll get to later, but I had it was it was tough, but not playing the guilt game because you know what? Because of it, I'm here. I'm at the University of Nebraska Lincoln. I'm gonna get a college degree. I'm gonna graduate from college. And that's saying more than anyone else in my family. I love my family so much and I'm so thankful that they sacrificed and they put in work. Just because they didn't get a college degree or didn't attend college doesn't mean they didn't work their ass off. I'm so thankful for my family. And I don't get it told them that. I don't. My mom, she's she's a single mom right now. But she works her ass off. I didn't tell her, but I had I had a dream that she actually she passed away. I woke up and my heart was just so sad. I didn't want to go wake her up though, because you know what? She was out working her ass off all night. Well, not all night, but you know. She's a great mom. 
Guys, if you don't tell your parents thank you enough, please do. You have no idea how lucky you are, especially those that have two parents that are together. It's such a special thing and unique thing at this age because everyone is splitting up and divorcing, which really sucks. It's so unfortunate. You know what, though? Guys, it's going to be okay. I promise you it'll be okay. If you think it's not going to be okay, you message me and you bet your ass I'm going to... I'm not going to do anything bad, but <laughs> I, I'll i assure you. Trust me, though. Everything's going to be fine. Keep grinding. Keep working. If it is to be, it's up to me. Thanks, guys. Have a good one.